Today's screencast, we're going to cover how to get started with application performance management using AppDynamics self-service. In order to get started, go to appdynamics.com and we'll fill out some basic information in the form in order to provision a self-service account. The first thing we're going to need to do is validate our email address. Here, I'll simply click on the link in the email. And this will validate my account. Once my email is validated, I'll be able to choose a SAS controller name. In this case, I'll make it acme-testing. This will be our controller moving forward. Let's see how fast we can get started instrumenting our application. Now that I've validated my email address, I can get started with the AppDynamics Management Server. If I want to access the AppDynamics Management Server moving forward, I can simply refer to the SAS URL at acme-testing.sas.appdynamics.com. Once we're in the controller, we can immediately start monitoring our application. In this case, I want to get started with the app agent for the Sun Java JVM and the machine agent so we can monitor CPU and memory utilization across all of our machines. Once these are finished downloading, we can get started instrumenting our... Now that we've downloaded the app agent and the machine agent, we can get, we can get started by installing them. Simply unzip the app server agent into opt app dynamics java agent. And we can do the same with the machine agent. We'll simply unzip the machine agent into opt app dynamics machine dash agent. Once we're operating and running, we can go back to our app. In this case, it's a Drop Wizard app. Now, the only thing we need to do to start monitoring our app is instrument it with the Java agent. In order to accomplish this, we'll simply add dash Java agent and then the path to our Java agent. In this case, opt app dynamics Java dash agent Java agent dot jar. And then we'll run our server. Now that we've instrumented our application with the AppDynamics Java agent, we can see the data is already starting to flow into the AppDynamics management server. From the dashboard, we can get a high-level overview of the health of our application, as well as some basic metrics, including how many calls have been made, as well as the average response time. From here, we can deep dive into each business transaction that's been automatically discovered. And we can also go and deep dive into the hardware to get CPU and memory information because we've installed the machine agent. If you'd like to find out more, please visit us at appdynamics.com.